The natural world is full of wonders, but is there anything more mesmerizing than things that glow? Mother Nature adds this touch of whimsy to the environment in many different forms, animals, plants and fungi, and in many different places. You just have to know where to look. No matter where you are, you're probably close to some of these sparklers, so here's a roundup of our favorite places to go for the glow. Waitomo Caves, New Zealand One of the most iconic examples of bioluminescence, the otherworldly glowworms of New Zealand's Waitomo Caves make even the most experienced naturalists stop in their tracks. In a striking display, the worms dangle from stalactites reaching down from the cave ceiling, blanketing the surface in a bright blue glow. Visitors can book a number of tours, including the main glowworm cave, at the nearby visitor center. Post-glow activities. Once you get your fill of the glittery critters, head over to the Ruakori Caves and Bush Scenic Reserve and walk the trail loop, taking in views of the rocky gorge and limestone formations. Vieques, Puerto Rico Puerto Rico is home to three bioluminescent bays, the most spectacular of which is Mosquito Bay on Vieques, a small island off the east coast. Mosquito Bay has long held the title of the brightest bioluminescent spot in the world, and for good reason, millions of single-celled organisms called dinoflagellates glow bright blue when disturbed, creating a mind-blowing spectacle for those who venture out on the water via kayak. Watch fish jet out from under your boat like shooting stars, and elect for a glass-bottomed kayak to pretend you are in warp drive as you glide across the surface. Note that the phenomenon is notoriously difficult to capture on camera, so just enjoy the magic instead. The glow was somewhat dimmed after Hurricane Maria, but the sparkling waters have bounced back to pre-hurricane levels. For the best view, book your trip on a new moon. Post-glow activities. After soaking up the nighttime magic of the bay, take advantage of the Caribbean sun, Head to the mile-long golden arc of sand at Sun Bay to take in some vitamin D and admire the turquoise sea. Great Smoky Mountains, Tennessee You can spot fireflies in humid regions around the world. However, the Smoky Mountains are home to 19 different species of them, including the synchronous firefly. As one would expect given the name, these blinking bugs have a little trick up their sleeves, for a two-week period from late May to mid-June, they flick on and off in unison. Evening access to this region of the park during prime firefly season is a hot ticket, and the park runs a lottery to avoid overcrowding. Post-glow activities. Stick around the National Park for another day and head south on the winding mountain roads to nearby Klingman's Dome, the highest point in the Smoky Mountains at 6,643 feet, 2,024 meters. On a clear day, the peak offers views that stretch nearly 100 miles, Dismal's Canyon, Alabama Tucked away in a rural corner of northern Alabama you'll find Dismal's Canyon, a national natural landmark home to the oldest accessible primeval forest east of the Mississippi River, i.e. a forest that has existed without any significant event, such as a fire or storm, affecting its growth. The canyon is a twisting ravine full of majestic flora and an array of wildlife, including the quirkily named Dismalites, glowworms. These tiny worms line the moss-covered rocks of the canyon, and when night falls, they glitter blue in the darkness. The best time to catch the Dismalites is May through September, and you can book a guided tour with the canyon's conservatory. Post-glow activities. Spend the evening at one of the canyon's cabins, and drive about an hour east the next morning to the Sipsi Wilderness, a section of the Bankhead National Forest that contains waterfalls, walking trails, horseback riding trails and canoeing routes. Motorized vehicles aren't allowed within the wilderness boundaries, so sit back and enjoy nature at its purest. Hachijojima, Japan glowing animals aren't the only ones to shine. The bioluminescent mushrooms on Japan's island Hachijojima make you feel like you are Alice in Wonderland. During the rainy season, which lasts from May to September, over seven different species light up the island's forest floor. Hit the hiking trails or head to the botanical gardens to get a closer look at the fluorescent fungi. Post-glow activities. Hachijojima is also home to two dormant volcanoes, photogenic beaches, and the top-notch Uramiga Taki Onsen, a decadent spot with free entry that overlooks a waterfall.